<laughs> Dude, I don't know why. Playing Ultimate makes me want to use my normal playlist. You guys want to hear the song that's stuck in my head? Press 1 if you want to hear the song that's stuck in my head. It's a good song. Step into the ring. Oh shit, this might be a little loud. Check something. What does it matter how long how loud it is? Choose your fighter. Joker. Aaron, you use schoolboy Joker? Is that the Choose alt that you like the most? Okay, this is the part that slaps. Do I have latency? Nope. Do you use Schoolboy Joker? Mainly? Okay. I thought I was gonna have to be the one to bring Schoolboy Joker to light, but I'm glad it's uh I'm glad it's you. It feels faster. I feel like he's harder to hit, but I feel like his moves don't have enough oomph, you know? I feel like the base disappears when I use Schoolboy Joker. Three, two, one, go! Wow, I can't believe that hit. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh. My buttons go. No way, right? I'm so carried. Holy shit. Gun F smash? It's a buffer trap. It's a buffer trap. Nice. This song's also really good. You did correctly? Yeah, you did everything right. You only get hit by one dare too, so you couldn't uh, you couldn't tech. What up, Cool Kings? What's up, Chappy? How you doing? I like messing with my muscle memory, but not to a bad point. No, I can't believe it. Oh, it's so weird how that works. Almost had it. If I grinded like a little bit more, I think it was dead there.
Oh! If only I had less rage. That was great. <clears throat> They're jabbing dash tech. Corns? Dash tech isn't too good. Jab isn't so bad. Jab is solid. Yeah, Corn's mid range is a little too good for dash attack. Eighteen. Uh is down throw down gun not trolling? Uh it's a it's a read. This song is good, but I don't think the song is stream ready. This song's good. 550 would divide by two. Why? I have the answer, but why? Ready? <laughs> Dude, hitting pirate is so hard. I don't get it. I don't know who's harder to hit between pirate and joker, and I wish I was kidding.
so far. We went for free? That's not true. Nice. She's just dead. I think that's a punish. Oh, he is. No, it's not even a punish. I just didn't do anything. Definitely not a punish. If I showed it that I won. <laughs> I'm gonna listen to this. Let me go back to my other playlist. Three, two, one, go! So weird that that combo is. So far, did I finish? I did, Embryon. That one was active for so long. Song via Perifico uh, FF10. <laughs> last time I played against Cosmos using Mithra, the last time we played.
Okay. <clears throat> Don't you LMAO me? <laughs> hmm. Go chic? Nope. Light Smash. Smash can be pretty hard to move in. Wow, I can't believe you made that back. It's like you're dead. I thought I was alive. so hard because like I feel like I have to stay grounded but side B stops any dash forward approach so what do I do what do I do cosmos Besides edge guard better, because that's clearly an out. Play better. Thanks, extra Kespi. Wow. Never would have thought. Gun's annoying. If you side me and I gun, I take twenty percent minimum, and you take like one. The risk reward just doesn't seem in my favor. Case in point, and like I can't dash forward. I don't have like the best aerials to combat your aerials because I don't have good frame data. Need to embrace timeout, Joker. Right jump. Son.
Nice. I feel like you can start skidding so early, but maybe that's a part of Pyro just being really slow. I'm a Pyro. Collins is practicing with Pyro. That's all. Crouch cancelled too, but it didn't matter. I think I know what I need to do better. Whoops, a little early. No, I'm dying bad. My Pichu? Pichu's trash! <laughs> Pichu's only hyped because he sucks! That killed? I wasn't dying well. I didn't think it would hit. You think about side B through gun? What do I do? I can't I can't hit you. Cause when you're in the air, you have bigger hitboxes than me, and it's really hard to hit up air on landing. I can't dash attack you because you pancake when you up air. So if I try to dash attack, most of the time my hit will whiff until you can shield. Um I'm trying to think. You have more range than most sorties, so like dash attack isn't as big of a threat. Besides edge guarding better. Play whiff punish. It's 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 hard to whiff punish with dash attack because dash attack doesn't hit Pyra. Like, if you up air into the ground and I dash attack, my dash attack will not hit. Cause the main parts of Joker's dash attack, there's like you never notice? Let me let me pull it up. You see this little pocket when he does his first hit of dash attack? You see how it hits mainly high? Well, you can't see it anymore. But you see how it hits mainly high? So if you land with up air and I try to whiff punish, unless I'm like god, by, by the time your character starts getting up, you can shield. And I'm not going to whiff punish with hit, like, even hit two of dash attack doesn't hit that low. So it's like, I can't whiff punish unless I'm dash grabbing and grab isn't that big. It's not that big. So yeah, it's, it's really hard. But there's a hitbox. There's a there is a hitbox, but I have to get so close to you that it's not like a good whiff punish. You know? I don't know. Joker Joker whiff punishing, I've never gotten it. Every time I try to whiff punish people, they just they just play ult. Or CQC. I'm Joker! Why am I CQCing? <laughs> I'm supposed to be the mid-range guy. I'm not Sheik. Sheik, I can force CQC. Joker, forcing CQC doesn't feel that good. 
Dude, this song's so good. With punish with punishing with Joker dash attack is really hard. With punishing with Sheik dash attack, that's that good stuff. Or like Fox dash attack, that's that good stuff. Joker dash attack, it ain't it. Mithra again? Yeah, Mithra dash attack? That's that good stuff. <laughs> really? I was hoping I'd take him with me. No way, off of up B1? Not up B1, just up B. <clears throat> out and fair edge guard? You think so? I guess fair is a little better than bear, but I do think more Joker should edge guard in general. Minmin Min Min dash attack is also really good. And Brawler. Brawler also has a good dash attack. But like Joker's dash attack, I don't know, man. Drew's too hard to play, he is. I'll try it out. I'll try it out. Jesus. What? Micro spacing, that was spaced well. I ain't about to call that micro spacing though. I'm not gonna call holding jab micro spacing.
That sucks. I didn't get the backwards jump. Nice. Oh, I'm so dead. <clears throat> Sucks. That was supposed to be F smash. I mean, it's hard. I don't know how to get in at low percents. Am I not supposed to get in? Is that my problem? Like, I want to get in. I like combo brain. Just don't accept not going in. Yeah, I'm carried. No way. No, I wanted a forwarder. <clears throat> that was great. Okay, Joker dude. I mean, he's fine. Base Joker's still really good. Dude, if we had Slippy for ultimate, this game would be so sick. Three, two, so excited. One, Aaron. What like random Japanese stuff do you want? That's not what I wanted. Random Japanese stuff do you want to learn? I can try to help. I'm not saying my Japanese is great. Because it definitely isn't. But I can try to help. I'm saying the most basic phrases. Do you wanna do you wanna speak to people? Or do you wanna listen? Speaking of people, it should definitely be a little bit of studying phrases. Trick? No, there's not. <laughs> Especially when people don't know you're a foreigner and they're um they're speaking really fast Japanese. You ever watch Zachary stream? Dude, Zachary streams and the way he talks, he talks so fast. I'm just like, bro, I would never in my life understand what you're saying. What the hell? I can't believe you got that. <clears throat> Great. 
great. I feel like if you ask for anime Japanese, what does that mean? Are you gonna ask people to talk like they're in an anime? Three, two, one, Let me use simple words. Okay, don't, don't say anime Japanese. I tell people to talk to me like I'm in elementary school. Or like, that's what I think. Cause some animes, they don't actually use like really simple Japanese. I want to get better at alt. I'm gonna have to think really hard about some of the things that I have problems with. It's not that. There's been certain things in alt that like I've been able to get away with because this game kind of promotes it, but that's not what the good players are doing right now. But he'll be in Hawaii until further notice. We don't actually know when he's coming back. It kind of sucks. I know. that situation yeah if i get good at it if i get good at it visiting family you could say that you could say that but yeah like in alt i feel like you can always just attack and get away with it because there's so little lag but I feel like sometimes it's better to just not attack and reposition. So just, yeah, I want to play Tekken 8, but it'll be hard for me to get into. Because I'm just, I'm not like good at Tekken right now. You know? Grabbing? Grabbing's so good.
Yeah, playing melee has actually put my brain in overdrive. It's kind of crazy. It still sucks that I'm playing Cosmos, but... Not the button I wanted. Feels very even. Hard agree. I didn't get the double dash. I keep sitting my jump air dodges. Offline and react to that 100% of the time. No way. Playing melee more, it has actually. It. it has, but that just means I need to play ultimate more for the gears to get going. You wish this matchup was even. You sounded like a real ultimate player right now, Cosmos. You want to see a losing matchup? You ever play against Sheikah's Marth and melee? Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> I feel like this magic feels easy, even. Using it? No, I'm not. I'm not. Jugger beats Aegis? I don't fully agree. Three, two, one. All and ult? No. I just think ult has a lot of even or like 55 45s. Jesus. I can't grab that. Can I get punished? From a full hop distance? That's crazy. Minus four? I don't mind that I didn't grab it. 
I mind that I got punished from a full hop. From this really floaty character. That's more of where my problems come from. I do wish there was more of a disadvantage to throwing Blazing End, but I also thought that move was garbage when this character released, so maybe this is my punishment. Dude, how much landing lag does it have? Higher up air. Which these two are the only broken ones. Ooh. It's minus four. No, I don't. I don't care about how minus it is. <laughs> like Sheik Fair is minus two, and it's hard for Sheik to get a punish on full hop if somebody whiffs a grab. And I'm a very fast faller. Pirate is a very floaty character, and I got punished on full hop. That's my problem. That's my problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that move can be as minus as it wants. Animation? No, I just think your down air or fair are way bigger than my buttons, so you have a little bit more leeway, if I'm not mistaken. Hard-ass character to hit, man. You got like a twig hurt box. He died for the air dog.
good TV series. I've heard, I've heard good things about you. Jesus. Find some good old ultimate right there, get me out. Just guaranteed. Hmm. I checked you out. Thought it was good. Pretty neutral about it. <laughs> Skull Joker. I can't. You know, like, when you're playing in tournament and you can't lock in? That's how I feel like when I'm playing Skull Joker. I also think Cosmos has infinite amounts of experience in this matchup over me. So it makes it really hard. <laughs> as soon as I say that, he does that. Maybe I just need to compliment him more. I don't know. Not complimenting him anymore. song so good. Jesus. This matchup on this stage feels a lot harder. Because I can't side B in neutral. Okay. Oh, I'm dead. Never mind. Oh, I didn't show Pokemon. The goal for Genesis. Oh, uh, just do better than what I did last time. Not what I wanted, but I pressed L. <clears throat> I think I got. I did really bad at SmashCon, so. What, 97? Last Genesis, I got 33rd, but. We'll see how that goes. 
Skull Joker's gross. Ooh. You had a friend who would compliment you and ask about your decision making mid match. It sounds annoying. Man, I'm playing Joker. Joker and Fox. Choose your fighter, Joker. Oh, I don't like. I don't like this one. I'd rather play Schoolboy than Akechi. I don't know. I feel like Akechi Joker looks really bad. Can be Cosmos with Solo Mithra? Uh, maybe? Do I have the mod? Nope. Three, two, one, go! Could still uh, directional air dodge there. Yeah, I think directional air dodge grabbing ledge. There's a lot of everything wrong with ultimate. What the hell? I'm dead. Music, music should probably be echoing a little. Let me hear it in my mic. Let's just eat the side B. There's no way. Silver three, nice. Ready? Hmm. Gold, it's only what, like plus four or five? It should be good. I'm talking Valorant, right? So hard to hit. Oh, 
Cat sword and a cat sword DB cooking. Auto attack, dude. Ultimate has so many bad mechanics. It's insane. You were too far. You weren't holding down. Let you know. Okay, okay. I don't have the mod either. If I, if you, if somebody has the mod, you can see it in the upper right of the arena. Yeah, bad mechanics, bad buffer. You're down. I don't like rotating online. Rotating online, I think, is really dumb. Like. You have literally the entire world to play against. So I feel like a rotation just doesn't make sense. Yeah, we'll play sometime. We'll play sometime. Rotation crew, the throwback. Yeah, this is fun. I might do this more on my days, but I don't want practice to be I don't want practice to be content. Three, two, so one, like that's go. one big step that I want to take regarding Oh, uh, what's it called? Regarding my stream. So we gotta find a way to turn me practicing for Genesis into content. Like, real content. Did I miss my tech? If I couldn't tech that, that's crazy. Might have been able to do um footstool gun there. Can't tech like for real?
not what I wanted. So you're gonna untech? Well, I know you can't tech off the ground, but I know that the ground and the side of the stage are not the same thing. Cosmos, that's why I hate down throw Nair, by the way. Because down throw Nair, some characters, they just neutral air dodge. Right? They just neutral air dodge, and then they get auto tech instead of, like, air dodge landing lag. And then I get punished. Jeez. Counts walls too? Damn, that's fucked up. Allow me to demonstrate. That's messed up. Byleth? I was going to ask your opinion on Byleth, Aaron. And I'm sure you know how I feel about Byleth. And I haven't even fought Leo in bracket. I haven't even fought Leo in bracket. I don't get how some people don't think Violet is top tier nowadays. Like, you really just think... Like, I always say it. You think Leo's still going to be playing Ike? Or Marth? I get that it's Leo, but clearly Violet is really good. Like, if you don't think Violet's top tier, low-key, that's disrespectful to everybody that was getting shit on by Leo. Leo's good. Most of the time, he is that much better than everyone else. But he's not that much better than everyone else. You know what I'm saying? There's not top tier. There's like 30 top tiers. <laughs> That's a lot? With a cast of 90 characters? That's how it be. I think there's like 8 people. What a game. I hate Byleth. Byleth is slow and the recovery isn't that good. Oh no. You, please tell me you're just... Please tell me you forgot a Kappa. Please, for the life of me, tell me you forgot a Kappa. If that's how you truly feel, that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. However, Byleth has one of the best recoveries in the game with the biggest risk reward. Oh, you fucked up edge guarding me? Die. Die. Doesn't matter how, like, and it's not like Ike or Krom. No, this is a gigantic button. You gonna say it was bad? The recovery isn't that good. And they get edge guarded. How many times in a tournament? Let's say Leo goes Byleth for an entire tournament. How many times do you think he's going to get edge guarded? I'm going to go with one. I'm going to go with one time the entire tournament. Even against other top 10 players. And you know how many times he's going to get a kill with these buttons? With the exact same recovery button. They have limits? What is- what is- Ready? 
I'm looking the other way. I am looking the other way. Isn't the song sick, chat? Three, two, one, go! Yeah, Leo is super sick. You know Byleth is slow, I'll give it up. Like, when I play Byleth, because I think Byleth is, like, really easy, I can't really get used to the movement. Uh, big hitboxes are really good to kind of circumvent that, but their recovery is definitely not the part of their kit that's, like, weak. One thing, too, and I, I say, I'm going to say this with my chest, I think I'm one of the best edge guarders in the world. Right? Case in point. I think it is incredibly hard to edge guard Violet. Also, Aaron, I agree. I agree. <laughs> okay, Ramen. <laughs> I also play a character that promotes. Ed I play characters that promote edge guarding. So it, it helps me out a lot. Watch Esam. Yeah, Pikachu is also one of the best edge guarders in the entire game. Like, if you show me any character getting edge guarded by Pikachu, that's not a character having a bad recovery. That's just Pikachu. Like, Pikachu can edge guard Sheik. Yeah, Violet is also a very good tournament character. Very simple. So the things that you have to do to succeed are uh, very like possible. You know? Nice. Almost died. Oh. Damn, I could have punched that. It's just an example. There aren't many other examples. And I think that's where the problem comes from. Like, uh, God, did. I think there was one time I was watching, like, Leo got edgeguarded by Riddles' Kazuya. Uh, I remember that. It was, it was a pretty sick sequence. Um, what else was there? There's only one? There's zero top Jokers. What do you think about Joker? There's one top Pikachu. What do you think about Pikachu? There's one... Oh, I guess there's two top foxes. Three, two, one, tournament character? Tournament character is a very big thing. Leo? Oh, no. Guys, this is exactly what I was talking about. Zachary? There is Zachary. But Zachary be using a lot of characters. Who's the second? Passeri, man. Why are you there? Then people be acting like, uh, there was, there was another Japanese Byleth. Do you happen to know the name, Aaron? Rize Osu's Byleth is really good, but there's another Japanese Byleth that's really good. Lee, Lee, Lee is really good. But trust, the things that make Byleth bad are not their recovery. Look at that. Fucking tether from the bottom blast zone. Incredibly fast snap. Tether from above the ledge. Justin Byleth is starting to do really well, too. He barely top eights. That's results! You don't gotta be the best player in the world to be considered a top rep of a character, you know? By the way, the song is hella sick. Yeah, the the slow the slow is a big deal. Slow is a big deal. Like that that actually matters a lot. They have giant hitboxes, but they are really slow. Jesus. I'm not saying they're bad, but you said their recovery is not good. Their their recovery is really good. 
That's the only that's like the only point we're arguing. And then you said Leo's the only one getting results with the character, and we're just saying who else gets results with the character. Japan is the best region. I actually think Japan is pretty up there. Japan was bodying us during the summer. But clearly it's not summer anymore. Am I dead? From mid-screen? Pikachu? I don't like Pikachu. I think Pikachu is overrated. Dude, Aaron, you're gonna fight random players in Japan that you've never heard of that are gonna give you mad trouble. I just hope you're ready. I hope you're ready. When I went to Japan before Genesis, uh, before COVID, I almost lost to my round one. Like, it was game three. Japan, Japan like, pools is no joke. Versus Zelda, I was fighting a game and watch, and they side beat. They they did Nair side B, and they got a five. If they got a nine, I was in losers round one. Yeah, it's nuts. Playing in Japan is awesome. Do I plan on going there? Yeah, I want to I wanna try to go in February. I wanted to go for Umebora, but it's too close to the new year, and I have a lot of other stuff that I wanted to do on uh, the start of the year. And then I might also go in Feb- I might also go in April. Because I know homies are going in April. But I was going to go on by myself in February. You're going in January? Oh, right, I forgot your, um, your what's it called? Your nose. Vlog it? I don't know if my viewers actually like vlog content. And I don't really like doing vlog- Jesus, that's safe. I don't really like doing vlog content. Ever since- Well, I mean, I'm not really like afraid of the stuff that I do. But I don't want people to see stuff and just take it the wrong way, and then social media be social media -ing. You know what I'm saying? Sorry? No, I mean, we're just saying. Because the whole reason that conversation started is because I was saying that uh, I wanted Aaron's opinion on Byleth because I think Byleth is like super OP. But a lot of people hadn't for a long time. And I think it's low key disrespectful to a lot of the other players when they're like, yeah, Byleth sucks. Like, Leo's just that much better than you. And I'm like, bro, like, Tweak is a phenomenal player. Debuzz, phenomenal player. Like, a lot of the people Leo is beating with Violet are really good players. So, like, if Violet sucks, then, like, these players are just, like, really bad, you know? So that was kind of how the conversation started. I'm gonna say Pikachu and Peach are overrated. No! What? I, I thought Pikachu was overrated... Since, like, April of 2019. Get your facts checked. I also think Peach has been overrated for a long time, too. I think Peach... Uh, I think the Peach one, there's a lot more evidence. Same thing with Pika. But I, I have my reasons for thinking that they're not good. Uh-oh. Yes. <laughs> you bitch.
You think Peach is insane? I think Peach's problems. What am I gonna do? <laughs> it's checkmate. <laughs> but I, I think Peach's problems come from Peach's like Peach is slow, but Peach is also slow in the air. Uh, kind of the same thing with Pika. Like Pika is slow in the air, so you can't cheat disadvantage. Pika's only cheater move is Quick Attack, and I don't think Quick Attack is as OP as people think. I think it's annoying, but I don't think it's as OP as a lot of people think. So when Peach and Pika are in vertical disadvantage, they are really bad. And Peach in comparison, let's compare... I, say, I would say Peach can be similar to Kazuya in archetype. They're pretty slow in neutral. When they hit you, they have good damage output, and they're really good at, like, boxing, right? But Peach's vertical disadvantage is worse. Peach kind of has float to recover, but Peach from ledge is worse because her just setups aren't as crazy. She doesn't have electric, so her ground normals are worse. Her grab is worse, right? I feel like Peach can get- Peach can actually get camped, and like, it matters pretty bad. Peach also doesn't have great matchups versus a lot of the newer gen uh, top tiers. But personally, I, I think Peach's problems, uh, to me, were there a little more beforehand. And I think the meta was slowly shifting away from Peach for a while. Pika? I think Pika just... When, when your best landing option is down air, and all of your other moves aren't that big, but you're pretty floaty and disadvantaged, it just sucks. Getting hit as, P getting hit as Pika sucks. Because all you have is quick attack. You don't have normals. Your neutral air dodge isn't as good as others because you don't have anything to threaten with. So you just go to ledge. And going to the ledge isn't, like, that great. But Pika... I also... I think T-Jolt is really bad at the top level. It's still pretty good, but I think a lot of characters can just throw out an aerial and hit it. Um, but Pika does have a pretty good grab game. It's just hard to get there. Like, if Pika's running at me, what am I afraid of? Grab and back air. I don't, I don't think backer is that good against a lot of the current characters. Because uh, a lot of the current characters can just swipe it. It's a multi-hit. You actually win the trade. You know? But I, I thought I thought Pika was bad since I played him in like April of 2019. Not bad, but a little overrated. It's really hard for Pika to get things to work. <clears throat> yeah, I'm, su I'm surprised. Mute, Mute puts in a lot of work to make Peach good. Like, if I had Peach somewhere on a tier list... And here's the, here's the thing with ultimate. If you're like an intro top tier... Uh, it's pretty hard, because there's like... There's like how many characters above you now, right? It's not like Smash 4 where you're a top tier and you're way better than like the rest of the cast. It's like you got a whole other cast above you. Like, being top tier isn't always enough in this game. Uh-oh. The horse race? Mm-hmm. Like, I still think Pika is, like, top tier, for example. I think Peach is, like, intro top tier. I don't think I think Peach is top tier. And intro top tier, that's when you get to, like, the 25 range. You know? He did it. Oh, there's Sam? Sam would still be doing good. But I, I still wouldn't think Peach is that good. Like, I've had this opinion since before COVID, but he'd still be doing good. Sheik top 30. I think Sheik is around, like, 30 to 35. Personally. Sheik has matchups that are really good, and then Sheik has matchups that are really bad.
Ooh, I couldn't tell. That low? Yeah, I don't I don't think too highly of Sheik. And the matchup she's good in though, she's like really good. No, my dash. No, my dash. Where'd it go? What's up, Waka? Maybe the 13. Sheik, Sheik does have to execute. Proto and Zachary. Yeah. I mean, I haven't seen an updated tier list, but Proto still thinks she's the best. Is Joker overrated? I think Joker is slightly overrated. Very slightly. Um, I think he's really good. I think he's really hard in tournament. But I think everybody thinks of Arsene as a pure buff. And I think Arsene has pros and cons. Violet Sheik? Sure, yeah. If you want to. So I still think Joker's really good, um, but I do wish people... People, you don't want to? Okay, you can switch. I think people can capitalize more on the cons of Arsene. Uh, which, if you don't know, uh, Joker loses Aha, so Joker's mid-range becomes a lot worse. Uh, and Joker's recovery is a lot worse, because Arsene up B is a lot worse than Joker normal up B. So he, he's really good, but if you can capitalize on those things while he has Arsene, Arsene becomes a little weaker. Kind of how I feel about it. But I, I still think Joker's really good. Joker's like the last surviving neutral top tier. Not like Diddy neutral, like, like Sheik S. Corrin? Corrin's pretty underrated. Like, Leo was fucking people up with Corrin. Damn, that earthquake hit that late. And then fighting this character, man? This character be mashing. Get him! He didn't get hit! about wolf uh i think wolf is getting like to the um oh this is huge to the parts of top tier that are a little uh overshadowed in my opinion
Oh. I don't know, man. That character commits war crimes. No way, that hit my grab. Sephiroth should be top tier. Sephiroth should be top tier. Uh, personally, I think Cloud is top tier. If he's not top tier, he's a good ass tournament character. <laughs> Cloud is not that good. <laughs> what? His recovery is amazing. His back air and cross slash is amazing. <laughs> Have you ever been on the ledge against Cloud? Cosmos, Cosmos. Come in, Cosmos. Cosmos, come in, come in. What do you think? When you're on the ledge versus Spargo, and you're at kill percent. You lose. <laughs> so here's, here's the thing. Cloud's advantage state is simple and effective. Cloud's disadvantage, he has amazing stats. He has air dodge to ledge, his up B snaps from pity pretty far. And if you, if you sweet spot his up B from below, it's really hard to two frame. His recovery is really good. His neutral is really hard to hit him. Um, I think his, his worst trait might be like vertical disadvantage, maybe. But, dude. I, I think Cloud is nuts. I think Cloud is nuts. Let Nairo, Nairo thinks Cloud sucks. I think he's full of shit. <laughs> Dude, this character is nuts. No, Cosmos, you never finish it. <laughs> you just do side B one and two and you just have people look at you. I can't dash attack that! I didn't know if he hit the ledge or not. Is that just a punish? There's no way that move is minus like 20. It might just be. And that move got buffed. <laughs> Cloud pre up smash buffs? Maybe. But now he has a really easy way to kill you in neutral. Oh god. Minus 24? Damn. That's bad. Please get away from me. <laughs> Oh, 
Odd, he's so easy. <laughs> Not that easy, Cosmos. <laughs> Everything people complain about with Aegis is also, almost also true. The one thing... Cloud's flowchart of advantage state at high, like at kill percents is just so strong, man. It's so strong. <clears throat> like, I'd way rather be on the ledge versus Aegis. Getting that border is huge. But this just shows I'm a little rusty. Burger hitbox for 28%. Or for 20, I don't think it's 28. Dude, I can't hit him. Stray giant minus three bears. <laughs> Dude, and he has a burst option that kills. This character is insane. Can't kill. Yo, Drago! Leave for the raid. Where are you streaming? Can I get a shout out for Drago? You guys want to see something sick? Like how he died at 60? No, <laughs> <laughs> oh, he got my head. How safe is Cloud Fair? Yeah. Minus three? Yeah. yeah. So that's not footstoolable? Minus six? Okay, so it is footstoolable. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. 
Oops. <laughs> I dropped you. I didn't think you'd keep jamming. I thought I was just getting me. <laughs> Why is your drive active for so long? That's not my fault. Here's how bad it is. It's not too bad. So one thing about this matchup that I learned from a little bit of practice, um, it'd be a lot worse if Byleth Nair wasn't like as good as it is. And what I mean by that is Byleth Nair is like barely, uh, it's really hard to footstool it if you mix in proper fastball timings. Badges. Pleb chat. Can I get ones for pleb chat? Are you supposed to get back? One. No! Our badges! Is this Cosmos? This is Cosmos. This is Cosmos. <laughs> What's up, PC? Thank you for the 17. Oh, what a hard reaction. No, Void, that was so bad. I thank you. Dude, I've had that happen in a lot of chats where I'm like, dude, I'm not even here. <laughs> like, <laughs> sometimes there's just another void in chat, and I'm like, oh. Oh, guarantee offline you were dead. Of myself. No, when I'm really mad at something, I do. <clears throat> oh, nice.
I'm gonna explode to one of these downers, and it's not gonna be pretty. Grab missed. Allow me to demonstrate. Terrestrialized suspect test for Smogon, right? Good. Damn, you still made that back? I almost didn't. Am I dead? <laughs> I got auto shield option at 50 near the edge and I just die? That's fucked up. Must be hella fun. Sometimes. On football, lost to in basketball for what bets? BGC is full reveal, and yeah, I think just as much as I love my Terra mix ups, I think just Terra reveal would be good. You play one more, okay? How's ultimate? Melee is unlocking my smash brain, so it's making me think really differently about a lot of situations, which I think is good. I think it's good. <clears throat> Damn, I didn't even realize that. I've been going for a minute. Ready? 
was very fun. It was, it was really enjoyable. Time flew. I didn't even realize. Chiyu, what are Chiyu's checks? Like, what can you switch into against Chiyu? Chiyu. you and Garganical sometimes? Okay. That's not a lot of Pokemon. Gosh, Splen? Like, actually? Final boss mode chat. <laughs> you said enough with this pyro. I missed my footstool. Nice. This matchup. We haven't really played Aegis versus uh, Sheik, except for this one stock that's happening. Side. That moves so weak off the side.
Was the first wait you never died of that <laughs> ggs ggs links for the games links for the games no that's pretty funny all right chat 